Hi Scorpio, welcome to my channel. This is your next 24 hours star reading session for you Scorpio. I hope you are well. I hope you are fine and safe and doing good Scorpio. This reading for today, this is your next 24 hours reading. Let us see what's coming towards you. What is the message uh, that is meant for you to know, ready for you to know? What can I get for Scorpio please? Before I start, Scorpio, I would like to thank you guys for coming back. Thank you so much for being here. Thank you so much for supporting the channel. Guest viewers, if you haven't clicked the bell, click the bell now and click subscribe. And if you would like to further connect with me, Scorpio, I invite you to also be part of our mailing list or newsletter. To do that, the link is down in the description box below. We have a new channel. The name of the channel is uh, The Next 24 Hours Reading. And that reading is more of collective daily. So if you want to connect with me on a daily basis, I would love for you guys to be there, Scorpio, okay? And all of the information, I will put it in the description box below, okay? So this is your next 24 hours reading. We'll pick up love and career and... Uh, finance and other general situationship what's the urgent message for you <clears throat> this is for scorpio king of wands okay the judgment card and ooh. all right so let us see what's coming towards you you have your first card is the virgo card <clears throat> and um so let me just okay so you have the hermit card you know you could be dealing with a virgo um you are really it's very icy <clears throat> you are in a deep contemplation on a big plan okay and it could be you know but it, it you you're not done with uh something that you've been thinking and this is relating to your fate, to destiny. Um, I would say there's some, there's a part of you, Scorpio, that you're not contented. And, you know, it's more of, I, I want this. How do I get there? So you've, you've, you've been really, you know, the hermit card, you're looking to the star in here. You've been really, you've been really preparing yourself and planning and doing all your best when it comes to this person or situation or decision. Let's get the clarifying cards in here. The Three of Cups. It could be, I feel like there's three women, okay? There's three person, okay? Three person or three women that is important in your life. And yeah, this is what you've been like, three person, like I'm really picking up right now there's three person that's really very important in your life and you would like to really organize something decisive for this person like an arrangement yeah you've got to decide so so some of it's a feeling scorpio that there's there's someone in this there's a choice. This is a choice between one or two or two, two to one or one or more. But there's definitely, for some of the specific, three women, three person. Uh, but this is definitely a very difficult choice to make. Um, Hermit card, three of cups. You've been preparing yourself to um, eliminate or to make a choice. And making a choice is to... I would say removing one of the person people in your life it's you know five of pentacles in here and it's a difficult choice it's it's a difficult choice it's a sad choice it's a difficult choice and it is also a very mature choice to do five of pentacles high priestess whoa you know you're, you're you're telling yourself, you're talking to yourself, you know, wow, that's a hermit card in the high priestess. This is difficult. You're telling yourself, you're talking to yourself, why it has to be this way? Why can I have all of it? You know, if you have all of it, it's going to create chaos and 
imbalance in your life so what i'm getting in here is that um you might get um uh, let me just close the door guys okay sorry guys just give me a second i'm just helping my mom okay all right okay so my mom called me and she asked for help and you know that's a mom anyway so yeah this is a very difficult choice scorpio and i'm sad that you have to go through this difficult choice of leaving something someone behind and it is a mature choice but you know you gotta do it you, ha you have to you know if you need to do it you need to do it maturely okay let's get one more card mm. you're very indecisive you're leaving someone or saying goodbye to someone who really makes you happy. You can only keep two. You know, let's see. Oh my God, Scorpio. Oh my God, Scorpio, you're here. Five of Pentacles, the High Priestess, the Two of Pentacles, and the, the Death Guard. Like, this is really heavy, Scorpio. I feel like it's a... It's one of those uh, eclipse, full moon reading where you have to make this mature decision to leave something, someone behind the death card. Yeah. Let's get an outcome card for you, Scorpio. An Eight of Pentacles. I feel like whatever this is, um, you're going to just rebuild yourself or once you make a choice you leave something and you move over to the next cycle and then you're just going to focus yourself on rebuilding what's left of you after that choice it is sad it's very sad to get into this point you know you would even when you make this choice you would distract yourself from working just to not feel guilty about leaving someone or detaching yourself from something from someone like to as the aftermath of this death card you would keep yourself busy to take your mind off of this person or situation scorpio that was that was a mature thing to do but it was tough okay i'm being asked by my guide not to uh pull more cards because the there's something unknown it, it could be experimental there could be a lot of there could be more it could be like it has to happen and the after effect it needs to be experienced by you or the people around you <clears throat> okay <clears throat> now you have the magician card okay the king of swords the star card so you could be dealing with a pisces an aquarius a libra gemini so this king of swords there is a lover let's look at the king of swords okay let's look at this king of swords they're knight of swords okay and they're nine of cups okay so there is a lover uh i feel like it's an ex it's coming from the past there is a lover uh, a romantic connection uh knight of swords nine of cups this person is chill so you've got a lover who's still interested to reconcile with you you know like look at that the magician card the star card so there's a lover uh from from someone in the past is i feel like this person is waiting for you okay what's the nine of cups okay four of swords yeah waiting i feel like there is a lover or someone in the past who's waiting for you to return or who is waiting for you they're chill you know knight of swords nine of cups four of swords they are very confident that you're somewhere out there and you like them there's a vibe with this person that i'm confident that sad sorry you could i almost said the word sag this is a scorpio reading so knight of swords nine of cups four of swords 
they feel very confident that they know they don't have a competition with you or there's a feeling of feeling confident that you would still pick them they're very quiet you know this person is aloof or quiet um they i feel very far away from this person or um something tells me that you're not forgotten in fact this person is waiting for the right moment you know nine of cups four of swords <coughs> sorry <coughs> so if you look at the if you look at the king of swords the star card the magician card they're waiting for the solid like they're waiting for a solid comeback the, the star card the king of swords the magician card they're waiting for a solid return, this person. Okay, let's see. One more. Yeah, two of cups. So, there's a person who is watching for the right time, like waiting for the right time to come in, like to see you, to be with you. They're full of hope and they never really lost hope about you and them. Two of cups. It's someone in the past. So, yeah like this person put you on a watch list i'll put you on a watch list scorpio you don't go away i'm, I'm gonna be looking for you like some, like look at that king of swords like they're somewhere looking at you and waiting for a solid return solid comeback solid connect and they're so confident they're so confident that um that you will be around like you will you, the both of you will be would still be reconnecting you know they, they feel that you're still available they feel that this i don't know separation or disconnection or the silence between the two of you it's 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 something to their advantage nine of so nine of pentacles they feel like you're still single and you're still available and you're still in love with them lots of confidence that when they pursue you you would still be in love with them they've got this thinking and feeling that no you're not taken scorpio you're still you know logically you won't be like you know they're using their head that i know scorpio that you're not available you're still you're still for me this this king of swords so yeah very hopeful they're full of hope that you would still be around for them I'm not sure if you're interested, but yeah, let's look at let's get one more card. I'm so intrigued with this person's confidence. Ah, okay, and this card. Ooh, this is hot. Okay, so yeah, this person Scorpio, they know their way. They they know they're they're in and out. Like this person, they 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 exactly know. They're in and out of your life. The way to get in, the way to get out, and the way to get in again. So they believe that in the next two months, you're still going to be single and they would still have time to pursue you. And they are willing to pursue you. They're doing, they're willing to do all of the work. They just, they just really are very confident that you're single. Something of that energy. Okay. All right. Now move on. Queen of Cups. Look at the King of Wands. This King of Wands, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, this person is looking at you, Scorpio, Queen of Cups. Let's see. Okay, they want to invest towards you. Okay. They want to. Oh, wow. <laughs> you know, I'm about to say that this King of Wands is willing to leave an old, like, they, they're willing to leave someone for you. Even the way... <clears throat> sorry guys <clears throat> even the way the full card is positioned to the judgment card I'm picking up a heavy third party Scorpio <clears throat> yeah three of cups and the seven of cups yeah so this person they have they've been stuck in a codependent relationship or they they're at the last leg of a of an ex husband ex-wife battle you know because seven of swords going to the hierophant like this person is so careful with the way they'll deal with their ex or marriage or separation but they're about to set themselves free from that bondage from that um 
huge block because look at them king of wands looking at the queen of cups is you they're looking at you scorpio they're looking at you they would like to take a risk and be with you judgment card you know i'm really getting like this person scorpio that they're done with the ex the husband the ex-wife ex-husband they're done they will settle that seven of swords hierophant card this person is settling something for you and them they're in this person is about to move and focus on you and them three of cups seven of cups uh they have dedicated a lot of emotions and time and money to settle uh divorce separation um ex-wife ex-husband rearrangement and stuff like that now this person seven of swords they will jump into the hierophant card seven of pentacles now it's all done the huge work that they've done towards cleaning cleaning clearing um you know relationship and i'm so in, I'm, i saw five 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 so they're done with that they're going to like this person will turn their back towards this mess ex-husband ex-wife codependent divorce separation they're gonna turn their back and they're going to now focus on the only person that holds close to their heart and that's you okay let's see yeah, four of pentacles, they don't want to let you go. Someone does not want to let you go, Scorpio. And I'm sorry they can't, they came too late, but now they're here. Okay, yeah, I feel like it's going to happen, this eclipse. Can I get two cards, please? Yeah, look at that. See, I told you. Look at that, the chariot card. They're in a hurry to release you, the king of cups. There is a king and a queen of cups. You have always hold the highest the most important part of their heart chakra and that's you the space that's really close to their heart is you and they're in a hurry they're so in a hurry scorpio to tell you that this is their plan um it's not gonna happen overnight but they have already rearranged or settled something and now they can now really say it to you that this is what i did and we can now be together yeah Wow, exciting, exciting times for them. I don't think, I'm not sure if you're excited for this Scorpio. And um, so this is what I have for you guys. Thank you so much. It's a pleasure doing the reading to you. I will see you very soon. Bye-bye.